The song really is about finding God in the midst of the chaos and the, the troubles and the trials that we go through and the things that happen that are unexplainable. And it's really about seeing God in the midst of that. I'll find you in the darkness When the light is growing dim So I wrote this song after the Manchester bombings on the 22nd of May, 2017. My initial reaction was just to cry. I don't think words could fully express the emotion, the, the connection actually that, that I felt. It's so close to home. I never, I never intended to write a song about it. I think what happens when you're a creative person is that you find yourself processing things or you find yourself questioning and you find yourself journeying through difficult things in a creative way. So the song really came from me just sitting in my bedroom with my guitar. I was just playing, you know, the, the chords that are in the verse through, just that nice picked guitar part. And I was just singing really, singing to God, really just expressing how I was feeling and expressing my, my heart and I guess the burden that, we've, that I was feeling and that we all felt as a city uh, for these people and for everything that happened and for the families and just the tragedy really that had taken place. Still At the time of filming it, I was unaware really that that was something that was going on. But looking back, it's very prophetic to have have it shot in the crypt, the place you know of, of burial, I guess, underneath the church, and to think that that would be where we would talk about hope and f and finding hope. Is, I think there's something really really special about that, actually, really significant in that actually it is in the grave when Jesus comes back to life, you know, and the, and the, and the stone is rolled away and, and he is risen, he's not there. And that's where we find our hope. So it's really quite a, a beautiful thing, actually. When there is a, a personal response to something, the overflow is always uh, for others. I don't think you can have this revelation and keep it to yourself. So I think it's really just an encouragement to say, if you are feeling in this place, you know, the place that I've been, the place that we've all been actually, um, whether we realise it or not, that they're, that just to remind people, you know, stay here for a while, but heaven is your home. I think our message to, to Manchester is that when things are hard, when things are difficult, don't, don't stay in that place, but shift your focus onto God, lift your eyes to Jesus, who is the author and of our faith and not to stay where you are but allow him to, to heal you, to, to change you, to come and be with you in that place. Stay here for